Live, local, late breaking. This is WBAL TV 11 News. All right, a man who volunteers his time painting is up for a national award. As Jennifer Franciotti reports, if he wins, not only would it be a dream come true, but it would pay off big time for a local nonprofit dedicated to helping sick children and their families. I totally enjoy the whole aspects of what we do. For Carl Dacus, every brushstroke is personal as he touches up the teen game room at the Believe in Tomorrow Children's House near Johns Hopkins. What started out as a single act of volunteerism has turned into a lasting relationship. Oh my gosh, we're going on almost 18 years. In that time, there's not a Believe in Tomorrow facility he hasn't painted, donating countless hours. It's made the full-time contractor invaluable to the foundation that provides housing and respite stays for children and their families undergoing treatment for life-threatening illnesses. He's a one-in-a-million volunteer. He loves to paint. And he loved to use that painting skill to brighten the lives of everyone around him. That's why Believe in Tomorrow nominated Carl for the NASCAR Foundation's Betty Jane France Humanitarian Award. NASCAR flew Carl out to Kansas City to meet owners and drivers, getting the red carpet treatment as it was announced he's one of four finalists. It's a roller coaster ride and cloud nine all at the same time. The public determines a winner. If Carl wins, Believe in Tomorrow gets $100,000 to help build and expand a respite house in Ocean City. And Carl, who is a huge NASCAR fan, will get to be an ambassador for two years. I'm hoping I just get to go to places, talk to people about our passion, help children in other places, talk to other charities, in involve more people in what we do so we can spread the word around the country that volunteering is just a great thing to do. And the, the give back is huge. To help Carl get across the finish line, all you have to do is vote online. You can vote every day, once a day, until November 19th. The winner will be announced on November the 29th. Here in Baltimore, Jen Franciati, WBAL-TV 11 News. Vote for Carl. Yeah, and we've got to say it is a wonderful we've organization. There, right? We were there. We helped yes. the kiddos. So they're, they're really doing great things. Yes, so they are. cast that vote if mm -hmm. you can.